So it's only natural to feel a little intimidated or scared when you're dealing with needles and having to inject medications yourself at home. But there are a couple things to keep in mind when it comes to biologics. So for the longer infusions, you want to bring things along to pass the time and feel comfortable. So in preparation of your biologic infusion, you may wanna bring your favorite book, some headphones, a tablet. Some infusion centers may have televisions available to watch shows, movies. Since you may be sitting for a while, dress comfortably. Wear something loose, comfortable, that you feel good in. If you feel cold, you can always bring a blanket. It may also be a good idea to wear a short sleeved shirt or no sleeved shirt with a layer over it. It'll just make it a little easier for the healthcare team to access your vein to administer the infusion. So many biologics that you self-administer, you'll typically get the first dose in your doctor's office. So you're not on your own. They'll walk you through the process, make sure that you're confident and comfortable in administering the medication. You can also have a loved one or caregiver be trained on how to administer your biologic if you're nervous to do it yourself. The other advantage to a lot of biologics is they're not daily injections. You only need to use them a few times a year. And also to keep in mind that many of the needles are very small. And in the case of an auto injector pen, you don't actually even see it at all. If you still have questions, or if you still aren't sure that you're doing it quite right, there are plenty of resources available online, typically through the manufacturer, including videos of how to inject the medication. And at the end of the day, if you're just not comfortable, you can always go back to your healthcare provider and ask them to administer your biologic for you. Thank you.